Right, Dan, what are we doing awake at? That's the wrong time, it's like 7 o'clock in the morning. Going car booting. And why is that a terrible idea? Uh, because we're going to come back with a bumper haul of PS2 games and Wii. <laughs> yeah, so we're going car boot sailing, and the reason why it's a terrible idea in Jersey, uh, which is where we live, is because it's a really, really small island, and there's pretty much no like retro stuff left. It's all been like slowly milked out onto eBay, and now, yeah, we've got we're just left with the PS2 and the Wii shovelware and stuff. But hey, I thought it would make a fun video. So we've made it here. It's uh, in a little like football pitch over there, um, but we're quite early, so there's actually no one here yet, really. Well, there is, but they're all kind of setting up. So we're just gonna have to wander around for a little bit. We need to go and find the third musketeer. There he is. It's the first sick deal of the day. Oh hell! Yeah. <laughs> So that's it, we're uh, on the way back into homeland now. We've finished the car boot sale. It wasn't hugely successful, but me and Dan are both walking home with uh, some PS2s and stuff. I'll show you a bit more of what I got when I'm when I'm back at home. But hopefully this has given you a bit of an insight of uh, basically what we have on this very small island uh, in terms of car boot sales and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I'll do a video of me cleaning up the PS2 another time when my hand's better. All right, so I'm back home now and uh, I thought I'd show you some of the stuff that I got. So the kind of the main decent thing I got was a PS2 Slim. Uh, I've actually been looking for one of these for a little while. I wonder if there's a game in it. Oh, no. Um, yeah, hopefully it'll work. I'm not too sure. Um, but I've wanted one of these for a little while, so uh, it's actually good to, to get one. Um, and they're nice because you can just like put them up or whatever. Um, or you can just put your Wii on top and they take up very little room. Looks to be in quite nice condition. There doesn't seem to be too much uh, damage or anything to it, so that's nice. Also came with some games. It got it has uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, it's got the disc and the manual in there, which is good. Also got uh, Aragon, which was actually a pretty decent movie when I watched it when I was like 10. Uh, also came with some controllers. As this. Also has a weird sort of adapter thing. No idea what that is. Um, so yeah, it's got the TV cable. It's also got the power adapter. It's got the official one, which is nice. And then I also picked up a uh, PS1 controller, which was two quid. I haven't actually got a PS1 controller, so it's nice to have one of them. Anyway, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, I know it was a little bit different to uh, the kind of videos that I usually do. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Uh, let me know what you think of this kind of video in the comments. Uh, if you want to see one of these uh, like twice a month or something, every other weekend, uh, then let me know. And uh, that's all for me. I'll catch you in the next one.